everybody. I want to let you know um, at this juncture, um, I'm talk about other things. Um, I want to say something. Um, I would like. To, um, I'm shocked that um, my mom passed a couple of months ago. I was not told to get off the subject. Um, I don't mean to sound cold because my mother said she never loved me or cared for me, or whatever it was. I'm kind of over that. So to be, you know, I rather, you know. My mom's out. My mom's dead. My father's out the country. My father's country. Thank you. Our daughter is in another state. My son's in the country. I have to cater to a sleaze ball because I have nobody. I'm alone. I'm lonely. My statistics is high. I'm thinking straight. I'm in the Bronx. Um, basically, I would have to cater to a sleaze ball because who will want me after a while? Because when you're in the Bronx, it's different. I'm an outcast. Disgrace at least will be a little better, but. An outcast is better, but one way, but in other aspect, you'll need somebody. And I'm talking about me right now, not somebody, me, personally. Excuse me here. Lady Treacherous, a.k.a. Um, all my other nicknames, but to get off the subject, I'd rather care to a sleaze ball because they treat me better. They don't make fun of me. They don't curse me out. They don't hit me. They don't kill me. They don't chase me to break my nose ten times. They don't, they don't make fun of me. They treat me better, not just sexually, intellectually, not just financially. Inside and out, mentally, emotionally, spiritually. And um, financials last, but they spend time with me, communicate with me. I give them what they want, and I give, and they give me what they want. That's it. I cooperate. I have a, I have a ditzy personality. And way is good because when you have clinical depression, it's kind of hard. That's why I prefer a sleazeball man to have the same illness, the same trait as myself. Because you know that person may be an asshole, but treat me like, like a royalty. I'll take it. I'll take the treatment from a sleaze ball and an aggressor. I'll take it. I can handle myself. I don't need nobody to tell me anything. Don't laugh at me. Because I should be laughing at you. I prefer a sleaze ball man and a, a, a female that's a bitch like myself. Nice to me, but bitchy to everybody else. Because I'm lonely. My statistic is high as a black Latino woman. I decided to cater to the Bronx and, and upstate New York, Canada, and the other states because I need a sleaze ball, a disgraced one. An outcast one, I could take. And a disgrace mainly, 100%. I will cater to a sleaze ball. I decide to make my decision. I rather cater to a sleaze ball because they treat me better. They don't curse me out. They don't call me names. They encourage me. I encourage myself. I buy plastic surgery for myself, not for a sleaze ball for me. I did body interior for me. I want to become a blonde for me. I want to become sexier for me. I want to change my looks for me. I just didn't have the money to keep it up. That was the thing because I had to go over time and medical leave for me. I just want to do things for me, for my career, to enhance it. Even though it's a regular job, no, I don't care. Something like adult entertainment, celebrity entertainment for me. For me. I want to have surgery for me. My cosmetic surgery is for me. That's why I wore these procedures. Blonde hair will work perfectly. And I hate to admit it, it does look good on me, though. Um, I'd rather sleeves ball because they treat me better. I just didn't have the money to keep it up, and I was canned to get black hair. And I didn't even use it. I just put it on the side of my building and let somebody else have it to go to Canada, and I prefer blonde hair. Black hair is okay, but I prefer blonde hair. And I kind of miss being a blonde because you have fun. That's how I look at it. That's it, basically. I have a dis personality. I've been hiding it for years. I rather a sleaze ball, but they're the only ones that understand it. At least they don't make fun of me and call me names. That's all I have to say. Everybody have a great day. Bye.